<laughs> Another sleeper. This was something else. Yeah, I love the story about this one. Like, so, so I'm. Never tasted these wines. The guy comes in, we taste them. And I love Washington State wines, particularly their Shards and their Malos. But, you know, I don't see them very often. And this guy comes in and tastes it, and I thought, I'm going to feature this wine. And he makes a deal. So, two weeks later, I go to this wedding, my nephew's wedding, in a very unusual setting at somebody's yard. Not that's unusual, but the set yard was unusual with broken down cars in it and stuff. And the bride is from England, and the bride family from England was at one table and I was entertaining everybody with the wine so I went around to each table and engaged this guy in the conversation. Mm -hmm. Heavy English accent. He says, uh, I don't have a good accent. He goes, by the way, have you ever heard of North by Northwest wines? <laughs> and I go, <laughs> I go, what? He goes, North, I said, for the first time, yes, last week, it was a week later. That's he funny. Goes, well, they poured in my boardroom at my company in Arizona. I'm like, what? <laughs> okay, now let me get to straight here. You've got an Englishman who's got a company in Arizona, and he's tasting a Northwest wine. Mm -hmm. I'm confused as hell right now. <laughs> Bloody hell. Thank you. Thank you. And, and for my next trick, well, this is great. This is an unbelievable wine. It's really, really, you know, I, the explorers. There's very little Chardonnay grown in Washington, and for good reason. It, it's it's a climate that's that's really made for and soil for Cabernet Merlot, Cabernet Franc, and they make some of the best of those Bordeaux varietals ever. I mean, those wines are phenomenal. But then you taste something like this, you go, hey, you, you know. You taste the fruit. It, well, it's got plenty of acid. Yeah. It's not cloying and overdone. And it's a little bit of oak in there. Mm -hmm. What a great balance. Really wonderful mid-palate, you know, and that's the most, that's one of the hardest things to get in a wine is tasting the mid-palate. I'm talking here. $19.99 on the shelf, $11.99 reorder price. And, I'm at 98 on that one. I, I, you know how much the way I like you described it, it sounded really good. It, 